Welcome back to this now. The South African Nuclear Energy Corporation, NEXA, has hosted a roundtable on the work of the entity and the organization's contribution to the South African economy. NEXA is a state-owned company responsible for undertaking and promoting research and development in the field of nuclear energy and radiation sciences. Now, the session taking place in Parktown, Johannesburg, was led by NEXA Group Chief Executive Officer Lois Ogebashe, who was also given an update into the 2021 NEXA Group's turnaround strategy, with the entity saying it's now turning a corner. SABC News uh, economics reporter Katle Holehodi and video journalist Tselo Sunula were there and have filed this report for us. The next turnaround strategy that was introduced in 2021 starting to bear results, uh, which is why we find ourselves in Park Town today, where the entity was giving us a sense of where they find themselves. Uh, we see them saying that really they're turning a corner as an entity, and we see some of those programs that we're done away with are uh, starting to come back. Uh, this is an entity that is very pivotal in the nuclear space, also important in terms of research and where we find ourselves. Often you'd hear uh, the Minister of Electricity and Energy talking about an energy mix and there's no way that we can find ourselves moving into the future without nuclear forming part of uh, that mix. We have some of those uh, nuclear programs that are already underway and NEXA are saying here today that they have identified uh, six key high impact programs that they'll be rolling out into the future and these programs would ensure that there is at least a nuclear energy secure future uh, for South Africa. I'm going to bring Mr. Simelani into the conversation uh, with us this afternoon. He's one of the group executives who will just give us a sense of where we find ourselves really lauded would be uh, the progress that has been made since 2021, the turnaround strategy, but we're seeing you saying that the future is actually bright uh, for nuclear in the country. Maybe give us a sense of where we find ourselves. It looks like things are really uh, starting to move where Nexus is concerned. Uh, yeah. We have identified six high-impact programs. Mm -hmm. Our CEO was talking about that uh, some, um, just a few minutes ago. Uh, and these uh, high-impact programs are supposed to take us to uh, to the next level as NEXA as well as the country. Um, I don't know if you want me to go back and just uh, give you uh, the six programs. The first one is front-end nuclear fuel cycle. Uh, the second one is um, small modular reactors uh, where we want to play in terms of energy in the energy sector. And we've got solidifying with neutron source generation that will also ensure that we have a we, we, we have um, security of supply in terms of our research reactor that we operate at NEXA and it also looks at how we're going to replace that uh, safari reactor um, in, in the near future. We also are involved in um, the fluorochemical industry and in the fluorochemical industry we're trying to turn around our, our organization, our subsidiary there uh, and we've got a couple of plants that we're looking at developing uh, so that we, uh, we, we solidify um, the activities in that space. And then we have the NTP, which is um, where we, are, we work on radioisotopes. Uh, it is one of the subsidiaries that has really been uh, doing wonders for us um, globally, and we want to make sure that we now um, expand that business uh, so that we generate more revenues for the organization and also play, um, try and uh, have an influential role in terms of um, cancer medication as well as, uh, um, as, well as um, diagnosis for cancer, which is what they specialize in. And then lastly, for us to, uh, uh, to achieve... Um, for us to really achieve our goal, uh, we need to have the people, the resources that will take us forward. So the sixth, uh, sixth impact program is uh, capacity building, skills and capacity building. Uh, and we want to make sure that we've got enough people that will assist us in, um, uh, in rolling out all of these programs. How important is it, Mr. Simelani, that we get it right? And where do we find uh, the issue of nuclear in the energy mix going into the future where South Africa is concerned? What would be the benefit of us actually getting nuclear right, uh, looking at the challenges that we've had as a country where energy security is concerned? All right, thank you. So I think NEXA has made a decision that they'll step in in terms of um, being part of the solution in, in trying to address the energy issues that the country finds itself in. Uh, as, a, as nuclear experts in the country, we feel that we, can, we have a role to play. Uh, hence, one of the high-impact programs, uh, we, see, we see ourselves talking about bringing a, a, a demonstration plant, which is a small modular reactor. 
in essence, the reason why we're doing that, we are really putting our foot forward um, in, in trying to address the, the energy problem. But as we are doing that, we're also looking at other areas um, where we, we can contribute as an organization. So these small modular reactors uh, have taken the world by a storm and we don't want South Africa to be left behind. And um, NEXA is better positioned in the country uh, to bring that contribution as a research um, institution. So we want to play that leading role in helping the country identifying the right technologies that will assist us in addressing uh, these energy challenges. We've spoken about, um, in future, the repurposing of coal-fired power station using, uh, using small modular reactors. We will then bring our expertise as, as NEXA in, in helping the country. So it is very, very important. I think, lastly, uh, nuclear power as a solution to power generation um, is very important now because we are looking at cleaner energy sources and it is a carbon-free um, technology that will assist in, in, in ed ed the eradication of, um, uh, of emissions and making sure that the country uh, produces reliable power which is clean um, and, and, and helps the country in uh, uh, in reducing its carbon footprint. Mr. Simelani, thank you very much, sir, for giving us your time. He's coming through as an executive here at NEXA, and you hear them saying that really it's all hands on deck and ensuring that these programs uh, become a reality, and they're looking at uh, really spending about or attaining about a 50 plus billion rand uh, that will ensure that at least we get the best out of these six programs. I'm Katla Holodi for SABC News in Pugtown, Johannesburg.